Dairymen around the world understand that in order to maximize the production and drive profitability on their dairies, they have to get their cows pregnant in a timely, efficient manner. Dairies around the world are increasing in size and it's no longer realistic to depend on visual heat detection alone to create the amount of pregnancies it takes to run an operation. Tail chalking is becoming an important heat detection system on dairies all around the world. As America's number one livestock marker, all-weather paint sticks are the perfect product for tail chalking cows. Hi, my name is Kevin Bosque. I'm the director of field training for Worldwide Sires. As a professional technician for the last 25 years, I've had the responsibility of creating pregnancies on my customers' dairies. The challenge all dairies around the world face when it comes to creating pregnancies on their operations is finding the opportunities to inseminate their cows. To operate at peak profitability, dairies should have at least 8% of their milking cows pregnant every month. Today I'd like to introduce you to a heat detection system favored by North American dairymen for nearly 70 years, and the heat detection system I built my career on, tail chalking with all-weather paint sticks. Created by Laco Industries, the original all-weather paint sticks are the only brand of livestock identification marker that gives you the quality that you and your animals deserve. Hi, I'm Bob Fox, a training specialist at the Worldwide Sires Training Center. I'd like to demonstrate the proper technique for chalking tailheads. The all-weather paint stick uses a special paint formula that is designed to be safely applied to cows and other animals. It will not wash off in rain or rub off prematurely. The paint is designed to be applied to wet or dry animals. When used as a tail chalk, it becomes a valuable tool for dairies. Pregnant cows on a dairy is one of the most important things to keep in the dairy operational. It leads to fresh cows, more heifers, and obviously higher milk production. Getting cows pregnant on a dairy can be a big challenge. We use tail chalk for heat detection on our dairy to get more cows pregnant. Using the tail chalk allows us to find the cows in heat by not having someone watch the cows 24 hours a day. It's kind of like having that person heat detect all day long without being there to do it. So tail chalk has been a very important part of our heat detection process. You want to start with a good base coat. You want to use a back and forth motion so you can apply chalk to all sides of the hair. If you chalk your cows in one direction, laying the hair down, it's very difficult to detect heat on these cows when they only get mounted once or twice. The proper way is to chalk your cows every day. You want to keep consistent with your chalk, the same length standing the hair up. You want to walk behind your cows every day at the same time. You're looking for differences in the chalk or chalk that may have been rubbed off to indicate that the cow may be in heat. Using different colors of the all-weather paint stick to identify inseminated and unmated cows is a common procedure among producers. To aid in your identification process, all-weather has developed the most extensive line available with 14 colors of paint sticks. Hi, my name is Man Madrano, a training specialist at the Worldwide Sires Training Center. On all dairies that use tail chalk, there's three types of cows in your AI pens. You got your definite no's, your definite yeses, and your suspicious cows. Right now we're in a 250 cow pen on a 3,000 cow dairy, where we're in the process of heat detecting. As I'm walking, I'm looking at the chalk for any different in color and consistency from the other cows in the pen. I'm touching up the tail chalk on my definite nose. I'm looking for my definite yeses, but most importantly, I'm hunting for my suspicious cows. This is an example of a definite no. She still has bright chalk left from yesterday, and there's no sign that she's been ridden. Here's another example of a definite no. Even though she's missing most of her chalk, her hair is uniform and undisturbed. But if you look closely, you can even see that there's bright chalk still left on the tips of the hairs. It's impossible for another cow to ride this cow and only take the chalk from the bottom portion of the hair and just leave the tips. So we'll just simply reapply the chalk and move on. 
Here's an obvious he cow. There's no doubt that she's been ridden multiple times. We wish all our cows were this obvious, but only about 50% of cows will be active enough in their heat period to show this kind of rub. We will look her up and see if she's eligible. She is. So we'll put today's date on each side of the hip and move on. And here's a great example of a suspicious cow and why we chalk the cows the way we do. If you just one stripe these cows or chalk in one direction or even put too much chalk, you will never be able to find these types of cows. So you cannot say she's a definite yes or a definite no. She's a suspicious cow. At the Worldwide Sires Training Center, we teach technicians a system for dealing with suspicious cows. The first step into dealing with suspicious cows is to palpate them. We always go to the uterus first, so if she's not pregnant and has some tone, then we check for mucus. Here we got an obvious heat cow. Standing right next to her is a suspicious cow. So we're gonna check her. So get our glove on. So what you want to do is find the beginning of the cervix and what you want to do is you want to collapse the vagina, apply a little pressure and all you want to do is do a backwards motion with your fingers to get this result. This cow's in a definite heat and eligible to be bred today. There's no such thing as a questionable heat, but there are questionable signs of heat. Remember, only 50% of your cows will show obvious signs of heat. Your suspicious cows are just as much as in heat as your obvious cows. They just didn't get ridden as much. Being able to pick out your suspicious cows allows you to find more opportunities to create the pregnancies that every dairyman needs to run their dairy. The better heat detection we have, the more likely an animal is to get pregnant. We want a lot of pregnancy so that we have a nice flow of replacement heifers, but also we want to have a lot of cows at the early stages of the milk curve that are approaching peak and peaking. You have to have good heat detection to make our breeding program work. And without good breeding, you're not going to have a successful dairy. So we want a successful dairy. So heat detection is right at the top of our importance list. For every day a cow remains open after 115 days in milk, it costs between two and three dollars per cow per day. So on a 200 cow dairy, that's a loss of between 400 and 600 dollars per day. That kind of potential loss is significant to the bottom line in any business. As a veterinarian, I'm commonly tasked to monitor both reproductive and health programs on a dairy. And because of that, we've learned that we come into an agreement with the cattle that we're working with. If we take care of them, they take care of us. Our top priorities on the dairy are to provide care and comfort for our animals. When you combine nutrition, consistency, a sound vaccination program, and sound reproduction program, which includes heat detection, you're gonna get a lot of pregnancies on the dairy. From a veterinarian, that's what I'm most interested in, is providing a system that takes care of our cows on an individual basis every day of the year. As America's first choice in livestock marking, all weather paint sticks are perfect for heat detection, animal health, sorting, grading, inoculating, and much more. The all weather paint stick is the most trusted and reliable livestock identification tool in use today. The all weather family of products uses environmentally sound raw material that are non-toxic and safe for all of your animal marking needs.